Do not have a protein shake before workout. Everyone for real. look as to what the employees of Jebel North go through on a daily basis. So Are we going to go in the kitchen? We will be going through the kitchen, oh, to the restaurant. It's delicious. Yes. Yes, one thank the, you. One of the best pizzas <laughs> in Laredo by far. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes, you'll be going to the kitchen. You'll be experiencing the girls there at the restaurant and as well as the girls here at the front okay. desk. So. so I'm really excited. And a little bit more. Can you tell us a little bit about the history of Jebel North? Yes, definitely. Um, well, Jebel North first originated uh, with their foundation with Judd Bull on San Jose back in 1968. And then from there, the Velas decided to open another business, which is Jebel North, over here in 1987 of May, May of 1987. So that's when they first opened up. For <laughs> we first, of course, originated the, started the bowling center with 24 lanes and it's well expanded in 2000 with 16 more lanes. Oh, wow. So we now are officially 40 lanes, you know, fully sanctioned USBC. <laughs> Awesome. Can you tell us a little bit more of, um, I know I hear about disco night on yes. Fridays. Yes. And disco nights is pretty fun. Our disco nights are Fridays and Saturdays. On Fridays we start like around 9.30 or so. And then Saturdays we start like around 8 o'clock. It's a, it's a fun thing we, you know, we like to have for a lot of the customers who like to come out, have fun. It's a family oriented business. That's what we like to target, a lot of families. And the leagues, because I know you told, like we know about the leagues, that there's some for girls. And yes, stuff. we have everything from a women's league to a mixed league to um, more power. Everything. Everything, <laughs> exactly, yes. Our leagues are Monday through Fridays. On Mondays, we have the women's league, which is the early league. It starts at 6.30. And then right now we have a league going on. It's a mixed league, so it's both men and women. Oh, okay. Do you have a league for like little like kids? We also have a league for children. Yes, we do. It's on Saturdays. It's at noon. You know, any children, any child who'd like to participate, it's an extra activity to give them something to do, especially on the weekends, schools out. You know, I think it's great. I used to be a junior bowler myself. I was yes, I started bowling since I was five years old, and I started from then, and then I worked my way up to an adult league. So, so you're a pro, huh? You're a pro. I wouldn't consider myself no? a pro, yeah. but. <laughs> Are you gonna give us a couple? Pointers well, not myself, but not myself, but I, I do have someone in mind to give oh. you a couple of pointers. Yes. Hey, great. Well, I'm excited. So, where do we start? Mm, Ladies, God, hair nets. Totally Here we go. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> so we're gonna do this. We're gonna do with style. Oh yeah. We yeah, have a carry. All right. Now this is Anna. Anna, she's Hello, one of our Anna. cooks. Anna. Anna. Victoria. <laughs> <laughs> Victoria Mildred. Anna, she's been one of our cooks for many years. Anna, how, tell us about yourself. Eight years. Eight years. Eight years? She's been working here for eight years, yes. So right now, Anna's cooking for us. Anna, what are you making? Right now, I'm making a botanic powder and a grilled chicken salad. Mm -hmm. 
that we out. do. We're we're not all junk food and greasy <laughs> stuff. Okay, what is your specialty here? Because every time I come, pizza. Every time it's pizza, but the, we're well known for our enchiladas. So oh. I would like to get you girls uh, making some enchiladas. You yeah. ready, ready for that? Yeah. 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 All right. So I'm, I'm all right. Let's yeah. do this. Let's come on this side. Go there. Tell me a little bit about yours. Well, enchiladas. our enchiladas, we, it's, it's an order of three. You can order it of two, of, of course. Here we go, three for you. Three for you. Um, three for me. All right, now our enchiladas, we don't use canned chili. We use chili that's homemade. We've been making homemade chilies for many years. That's yes, yeah. so our chili here, this is homemade chili. This is chili made from scratch right here. Wow. Okay, all right, now steps to making enchiladas. Here we go. We're gonna do the enchiladas. We're gonna get our tongs. Here we go. Anna, where are the other tongs? Over here. Here we go. You girls, I'm gonna have you girls do it and I'm gonna walk you through it. Okay. All right, you're gonna get the enchiladas with your tongs oh, all so as such. Here? Yes. Now you're not gonna squeeze them too hard. If you do, they, they rip. Right, okay. Yes, so we're gonna dip them into the oil. Don't be scared, it's okay. Oh, okay. We're gonna dip them into the oil. You're gonna see they're kind of, we're gonna wait until it gets a little loose, pick them back up, uh -huh. and then bring them back down. All right, and bring them over to the grill. Here. All right? Don't do it the same. So just let yeah, it go. just let it go, put it right there. Okay. Ah. Do it the same, okay? <laughs> you can bring the tongs down, put them over here. Get it to the plate. We're gonna put it on a plate, okay? Bring them over here. All right, ladies, now down here we have our plates, so they're not as hot as you think. Trust me. Go okay. ahead and bring the tongs over here. Your plate, your plate. Get the enchiladas. They're not hot at home. There you go. They're not that hot. There you go. <laughs> Put them on the plate. Now let's come over to our station right here. Okay. We're going to open up here our deli area. Ooh. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> this is where the right. Now I'm gonna do one and have you girls do the other, okay? okay. We're gonna get just a little bit of cheese. Do that, and then you just roll them up. I'm sure you all have had, you know, your moms know or cook. grandmas. We yeah. Know how to cook. Yes. yes, okay, no one say anything. You never know. It's all right, over here. <laughs> no, of course. Everyone everyone has a little cook in them. So please go ahead. Okay. Right now I overstuffed my enchilada. <laughs> A little bit of cheese, a little bit of roll. That looks really good. Mm. And there you go. You oh. want to put it face down <laughs> so that it won't The one that knows how to cook. Yeah, <laughs> sure. Uh, grab your plates. Let's come over to the chili. Chili time. <laughs> Ooh, I want chili first. Wait, sorry. <laughs> okay. We're going to come and we just tend to, you know, just put what's a sufficient amount. We're just gonna come and yes. Oh wow! Here we go, just like that. Here we go. Looking for a try. You wanna do it? Yeah. All right. I'll try. Wow, this is delicious. And I'd like to point out that I made this chili batch. Oh! I made it. I made this batch this time. <laughs> like, like that. Hi, Martha. Okay. Also known as. Chiquillas. Oh, chiquillas. Chiquillas. Oh. Chiquillas. Hi, chiquillas. Como están? Not doing one good. of our employees in trouble, North. Oh my God. Can we take a couple of... All I need is five minutes. Ready? Cheers. 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 Delicious. Look, cheese. look at this thing. Oh, my God. Mmm. Wow. Can we get one we break? I'm not kidding. I'm gonna finish the whole thing. So good. Good job, Belinda, with the chili. Oh, thank you. Thank you. So are you yeah, sure so you good. can't give us the recipe? Give the recipe? I promise I can't. No, I take that to my grave. <laughs>
it all gets started, basically, yeah. okay? You get your lanes, you know, either by game, by hour, depending on our daily specials. Of course, we have a website also, jetsbowl.com, J-E-T-T bowl.com, and that has every, all our prices there, being from our daily games, uh, nightly games, hourly specials, and our family specials, as well as birthday specials as well. We do host birthday parties here. All right. We should host a birthday party here. Yes, for Aaron. For Aaron. Oh, we'll have a party for Aaron. Yes. <laughs> That'll be fun. All right, ladies, what sizes are you all? Let's get both. What do you think? Yeah. Five, seven and a half. Eight. Okay. Oh. Oh, that was good. That was real good. Six and a half. Five and a half. Six and a half. Six and a half. You know, very organized. And they don't smell. They don't smell it. If they do, do not worry. We carry Lysol. Tiffany, show them the Lysol. I got a puppy. Lysol. Lysol. Alright, let's get it. Jerry, how much do you need? Victoria, Mildred, or Victoria? Hello, Victoria. Jerry Ramirez. Jerry Ramirez is one of our bowlers. He's been bowling here for many years. And Jerry, tell us a little bit about yourself. Oh, I've been bowling. Actually, I started bowling late, uh, but uh, I've been bowling for 26 years. And uh, I mean, I love the, the sport of bowling. I mean, I have been all around sports fanatic, but uh, bowling is your game. Yeah, right now, bowling <laughs> is my game. So I hear you're like the best. Yes. Uh, I'm not here to spoil yourself. How many 300s do you have? Uh, actually, 22 300s. 22 300s, yes. And what? A 300, like what is it? It is considered a perfect game, it's 12 strikes in a row. Oh my god! So it takes a little practice, a little bit more enthusiasm, a little bit more heart into it. It's very difficult to do, but it's, it's doable. And you know, with practice, with knowledge, anybody can do it. I mean, that's my opinion. I always like to help anybody to, to perfect their game or to do better. So you can help us today. You're gonna give us a See if it's heavy for you. Good. You good? Can you try it? No, it's good. It's good? It's a good size, yes. Okay, we can try that then. Okay. The, whole, the whole object of this of bowling is one, relax. Have, you know, you're going to enjoy yourself. You're going yeah. to you're gonna be able to throw the ball. And first of all, we like to not cross the line because if we cross the line, Yes, it's oil. A lot of a lot of people do not know this. There's oil beyond that line, so if you cross it, you tend to slip and you can hurt yourself. So you gotta be careful. So usually we take four or five steps going towards the coach of the bowling of the, of the line before they get the line. See those arrows over there? Yes. Okay. We try to basically look at those arrows and that's that's our target. Okay. So you being started, we try to, you know, always try to get like between the first or the third arrow, something around there, so because the ball is going to go straight. Okay. okay. There's a lot of people here that have experience, and they tend to curve the ball a little bit more. As time goes on, I mean, you'll be able to learn that, but you know, it takes practice like anything. But for right now, we're going to have fun. I just want you to to enjoy yourself. I want you to just relax. Okay. Get yourself. You hold it? Yes. Just get your get your fingers right here. Let me show you. Just get your fingers, your two fingers here, and you're gonna put your thumb, and you're just gonna hold it like that. Okay? And you're gonna, yeah. Take a long horn. Yeah, there you go. So actually, just keep yourself nice and balanced. This, is your, this hand is gonna help you balance yourself nice and straight. Do not move your head. Don't go, because if you move your head, you're gonna go all crooked. So you just try to nice and straight. Look at that arrow, and just try to go nice and smooth. He has to kick the leg. Yeah, a little balance. This is just to keep you balanced, okay? <laughs> like a, like a yeah. <laughs> ballerina, ballerina. <laughs> Sometimes we, we have a lot of bowlers that we tell them that they do good, like like ballerina. So okay, okay. I don't. You want to try it? Okay. Let's see. All right. Hold your fingers. Okay. Nice and straight. Try to do four, or five steps. Okay. okay. As far, as One, long, comfortable. Two, two three, three, four, five. Okay. There you go. Ah! Whoa! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. yeah, everyone's a radar. Yes, great advice, obviously. Yes. I see with the knife that you gave me. Oh my God. <laughs> no, okay. you can bring that one down. Wanna bring that one down? Yeah. Okay.
Now you're gonna do the opposite. Now, yeah, you're gonna stand. Every time you have a corner thing, you do the opposite and you do you aim at the same at the, at the same okay. the same arrow right there. Just do the same thing, but the same arrow you did right now. Wait, this the arrow? arrow? The middle arrow. See how the ball goes automatic yes. that way? Yes, okay, so okay. That's why. You know I'm looking at all the bowlers, like they have their own technique, the way they curve. Yeah, the Look curve. at these balls. Awesome. Yeah. They're like different kind of balls. They're all stones right here, and they're all nice. Unique, they're all they're different. Customized they're, too, yeah, right? they're all customized. They're fitted to their hands. So fitted every single, hands? yeah, all of them are fitted to their hands. There's, oh, wow. So probably one of them will not fit you, like this one will not fit me. I have my own equipment, so. Uh, and we have a pro shop here that will help, help okay. you out whatever you need. Go Mildred. Okay, your turn. Go Mildred. Just remember, huh? there you go. Just like that, keep it. All of your thumb all the way in, and all you do is just go through it. Just visualize your, your, your target, which is the middle that there are in between. Visualize your target. And just, somebody said. And just go through it, okay? In between the middle arrow and the third arrow. Just go through it. That's all I want to do. Go, Mildred! Woo! Oh! It's oh. <laughs> okay! Oh. <laughs> okay, you have. This is, the good, this is the good part about bowling. You have a second, a second chance. chance. Yeah. Okay. Now, remember, nice and straight. The <laughs> reason why, nice and straight. That's all you need to do, okay? Nice and straight. Go, Mildred, go. You got this, Mildred! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I heard it! There you go. Yay! I know! Now, like, I'm, I'm really enjoying bowling. I want to come in now and... Yeah, so there's a little bit of everything, a little bit of something for everybody. Um, regardless of age or gender, you can come out here and have a good time. 
come out here with your family. As you can see, we have the uh, big disco party ball. going out. Yeah, it's a really good time to come out here and spend time with your family and, and uh, have a good time. Uh, sort of share an adult beverage with, with your significant other, and the kids can have pizza. And there's video games, and again, it's a little bit of something for, for everybody. And for like fundraising and stuff like that, it's not just for school, so it can be for. No, no, it could be for anything. I mean, we've had uh, fundraising for uh, medical expenses. Okay. Um, uh, obviously for school for school fundraisers um, I mean anything that you can think of um, there's been people come out here and and raise money and and what we do more times than not is we will make a donation on behalf of jet bowl towards the cause whatever that cause might be so uh, it's a great opportunity for us to give back to the community so right we went to the kitchen your food is Amazing! Oh, I couldn't have enough. I swear. The food is pretty good. Um, it's very we're, good. We're famous for the enchiladas. Um, that's been, you know, our our staple dish since I was a child at the old Jet Bowl. And uh, anybody who's grown up around Laredo knows that so you, you want to have a good enchilada plate, you come to you come to Jet Bowl. The pizza's pretty good. The pizza's pretty and good as well. The yeah. chi chili cheese fries. Chili cheese fries yes. are my favorite. They are good. Found that good. they're so good. I swear they're like my favorite too. Yeah, they're good. Not, not necessarily good for you, but, uh, but they're uh, good. It's okay. We can once in a while. Every night, cheat yeah, day. You have a cheat day, day and you'll be okay. <laughs> Okay, so Belinda, tell us what's going on right now. Well, this is what we call um, our disco night bowling. Our disco night bowling, it's every Friday and Saturday nights. Uh, Fridays is at 9.30, Saturdays is at 8 o'clock. It's something that we do, you know, fun, family oriented. Something that we get. It's just great for everyone. Adults, children, you know, families. It's great for everyone. It's very convenient. I love it. I like I like all the colors. And they light up. And the tables too, right? The tables, the tables as well. Yeah. You know, we get the close up. It has a, it pops out the, the black light? Yeah, the black light. Yeah. Uh, bowling pins, bowl, uh, bowling balls. So. Oh yeah, it's, really, I love it's it. really fun. I love it. We have the jukebox play. Hello, ladies. Victoria, these are some of our employees. Victoria. This is Rebecca. Hi. Hi. Christy. Victoria. And Marta. Hello. <laughs> these are some of our, our few employees who work at the restaurant. Today, okay. we're going to go ahead and shadow Christy. Okay. She's going to go ahead and uh, give you some pointers as to what it's like to work at the restaurant and stuff like that. So. Okay, Mom, let's, let's follow Chrissy. Okay. Yeah. Follow Chrissy. Chrissy, so, go, you have to go, teach go. me good, okay? I can't go, fail. Go, 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 go. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, you know what well, we our, our computers are touch screen, mm -hmm. so um, it has we sell everything here at the restaurant. A lot of the, the stuff that a lot of people get right away are like nachos, popcorn, of course they also order from the kitchen as well. This is what you're gonna do. What okay. usually when we get a customer, it's usually you know basic customer service. Sir, how may I help you? Can I have some nachos, please, and a large Pepsi? Not nachos and a large Pepsi. Yes. Nachos, we ask if they like oh, jalapeno. Okay. Do you like jalapeno? Yes. Okay. And what size of Coke? Yes, right? yes the size large. size. Large. large. Okay. Okay. So then we come over here on this side. This is where we have our nacho bin. Okay. Okay. Grab the grab the nachos. Which one? It doesn't matter. It don't matter. No. Okay. Use the uh, the cheese over here. Now the portion of cheese, it really doesn't matter how much we serve. Usually it's just something, you know, to evenly distribute it out. So okay. go ahead. Like that? Yeah, go ahead. Don't be shy now. Alright, there you go. That looks good. Now you want the jalapenos? Okay. And where do I put it? Like Yeah, no, just next to the bowl. There. Okay. Wait, we're not done yet. Hold on. And then <laughs> large Don't yes. Right there. Okay. Alright, so right here. We have everything from large, medium, small. So go ahead and get the large. What did you say? Oh, Pepsi. I was gonna give him Dr. Pepper. No. <laughs> and how much ice? Like, ice there... usually we fill it up like halfway. I can't see. Yeah, that's about halfway, that's, right? It looks good. Okay. So then oh. Pepsi. And the Coke, where does it go? Oh, the the Coke, as long as you, you see that uh, line uh -huh. right there, okay, it's gonna go up to there. That's 24 ounces okay. right there. Okay, and then we just put a lid and then. Here we go. Thank you. All righty, sir. Thank you so much. How much will you rate me from a one to a ten? A ten. A ten. Yay. <laughs> Give me five. I like you. <laughs> well, that was fun. Did you have fun? Yeah. It's a little bit stressful. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, wait, wait, what? What? What are we doing, right? Yes. Yeah. No. They are. Sometimes we get a lot of customers. We offer slushies, of course, margaritas, you know, and then um, popcorn. Everything. So, yes. Wow. I I'm glad you all had fun. Thank you so much for visiting us. And Thank please, you for don't be strangers. You know, with the food we serve, you know, the, the stuff we have here, the friendly employees. So please, by all means, come back again. I feel like part of the family now. Yeah. And I can come I consider work. you all family. Yeah. It's locally owned.